All right, hi. Let's unbox this 400 watt portable solar panel blanket from Renogy. I have an old Renogy 100 100 watt um, some kind of a suitcase uh, 100 100 watt only, and I thought like it's not even uh, generating 100 watts, so. I thought I'd buy this new. This is not new, but uh, I guess it's uh, much, much better at uh, 400 watts. So I already opened the. Uh, I already opened the box, and uh, inside should be the. Nice package, nicely done. Really so we'll give this a try. I don't know about you guys, but I'm always careful of uh, removing feather, not rip apart any plastic bag. I just open it like it was closed. So this is it. It's got a nice, nice handle there for carrying, and um, it's not really that. To, I mean, I'm a senior citizen, so <laughs> and I can uh, lift it and carry it without any issue. It's just got this nice name there, Renogy. It's the back right there. Plenty of uh, Angkor to tie it. So let's uh, unbuckle this first. Each side has this nice there it is. Let's let's place it where it's got all the sunlight. Uh, let's put it there. Let's try to place it where I can just plug it right away. Let's place it here, flat on the surface. See how nice it is? That's my rigid uh, panel, solar panel, 190 watts. We're gonna hook it up once we get this. Uh, All right, we forgot to open that little pouch there. Let's see what's inside this pouch. So it's got all the paperwork. There's two versions of this um, <clears throat> blanket solar panels, the 200 watt and the 400 watt. And these are all the documentations. Very simple. It's got um, a shoulder strap, which is pretty good. You can adjust adjustable and there's two of them I don't know why they 
we supplied a couple of this which is pretty handy maybe and I'll show you <clears throat> what the um, specifications of this it's right there the model number I don't know if you can see that the optimal operating voltage 33.60 volts the optimum operating current is 11.9 um, open circuit voltage is 39.20 volts and short circuit current is 13.1 amp the weight is around 16 pounds so this uh, is compatible to my blue 80 ac 180 because it can take in uh, around um, the most 60 volts and um, about 400 watts so let's let's connect this to my blue 80 which is actually inside the house So I got this all set up to go inside the house. Let's disconnect the rigid panel here. I don't know if you can see me. Let's um, spread out the spreads out again. All right, there it is flat on the ground. So let's see if uh, <clears throat> let's go inside and see what the what it's generating. Connect here. Let's see how much power it's generating. I'm not uh, forty percent now. It's hundred three going up. Hundred two. And by the way, I'm in Arizona. I'm in Arizona sunshine or sun. So it's hundred three. I wonder what's going on. So let's go up. Let's go out again and see if there's anything that. Uh, let's go out and check out. So it's flat on the ground, so I wonder if it needs to be... Um, let's see if I can um, place this a little bit on top of my rigid panel. Let's see if we can generate a little bit a better... Because the sun is right there on that side. So let's see if I can... Uh, What I'm doing is I uh, place it a little bit incline against my rigid panel, just 
like that and see if that would uh, generate more let's go check well <laughs> it went down to 90 that's strange Something's not right. And I've got everything open. Maybe because of the tree there that's blocking it so I'm gonna move this a little bit I think it's blocking um, a little bit of the sunshine let me move that a little bit Wonder if that uh, makes a difference there. Let's check. Hundred twenty three. So it's like, um, Eight. It's it's not the middle of the day yet, so I'm gonna give it another try later. Um, it's like uh, right now it's, it's uh, almost eight o'clock in the morning, so that could be the reason. So I'm gonna give it a couple hours. See if that would uh, that would bump up the. But anyway, uh, that's about it. That's the uh, that's the Renji 400 watt. All right. Thanks for watching.